Welcome to Tasker 101 Tutorials. This is Lesson 7C. So we are building on what we, the project that we started in Lesson 7, which is creating a, a profile and a task that anytime we receive a text message, if the person it's from is someone who is in our contacts, then uh, it will announce the name of the person who's texting us. Uh, in Lesson 7B, we made it a little bit more advanced, and we created three different phrases, three different different ways for it to make that announcement and created a, a random variable so that it would select randomly which one of those ways to use each time. In Lesson 7c, this lesson, we're going to uh, uh, just solve what could be a little bit of a problem with this profile and task. Uh, you probably don't want your phone announcing who is texting you if you received a text message and you're on the phone, right? So, how do you prevent that? Well, it's not that complicated. Uh, basically, what we want to do, you see profiles can be turned on and off. So, if I turn this profile off, then that's no longer going to work. No one's, I'm not going to, my phone's not going to announce who's texting me. So, what we want to do is we want to create a profile and a task that will turn that off for us automatically anytime we're on the phone. So, first we're going to start out by creating the task. We're going to create uh, 101. Got to get in the habit of doing that. You guys don't need to do that, but I do it so I can separate uh, the, the lesson task from my own personal task. 101 text announce. I'm just going to abbreviate off. And we're going to add a task by clicking the plus button. We're going to choose tasker and profile status. Select profile status and you see here the name of the profile. You can select the magnifying glass also known as a search button. I call it a magnifying glass and uh, you select the uh, profile that you want to disable. Uh, what did we call that profile? See, this is the problem because I didn't put 101 in front of it. Um, I think we called it text received. Text received, and we're going to say set off. You could change it to off, on, or toggle. We're going to have it set off. And that's it for that one. I'm going to jump over to my profiles just to make sure I chose the right one. Yes, I did. Text received. That's why I need to put a 101 in front of these so I know it's not the one that I created for my personal use. And then we're going to do a, another one. Plus, and we're gonna go, I'm going to go 101. You can admit that. And then I'm going to go uh, announce text on. And I'm going to click the plus button. I'm going to select tasker, profile status, search button and select text received again and this time set on and we're good so now we have two new tasks one that turns the profile uh, off and one that turns it on so now we just have to create a new profile to trigger those tasks so we're going to create a new profile and this is going to be, uh, we'll call this 101 on call. And we're going to use state, which uh, states are anything that is a state of the phone, such as on a phone call. So state, we're going to choose phone call. And you have the option for incoming call, outgoing call, or any. We're going to say any, because it doesn't matter whether you receive the call or making the call. I don't want my phone to announce text. You could add a specific number if you did that. Then this would only trigger if you're calling or receiving a call from that specific number. But we want this to trigger with any number. So we're going to leave that blank. We're going to save that. And now we choose the task we want it to trigger. Uh... We want it to trigger text announce off. So now, as you see, text receive profile is on, and 
101 on call is on and anytime we make a call or receive a call it's going to trigger the task that turns this profile off. So what happens when we hang up the phone? Well as of now nothing. So it would turn this off and leave it off. When we hang up the phone, when we end the call, we want it to turn it back on. So in order to do that, we're going to long press on this. When you long press on a task, it allows you to add an exit task or select a different task or just unlink that task altogether. We're going to add an exit task. And we're going to select 101 announce text on. So what this will do is when we make a call or receive a call, it'll trigger text announce off. That task will turn off our text received profile so that it will not announce anything. Nothing will happen when we receive a text. When we hang up the phone, so the state has changed, we're now ending that state. It'll trigger the exit task, which is the task 101 announce text on. And that task we created turns the text received te uh, profile back on. So it'll turn it back on. So we basically just created, to go back and review, we created two tasks. One that turns the profile for received text off and one that turns the profile for received text on. Then we created, a, after the, we created those two tasks, we created a profile uh, to trigger any time we are on a call whether it's received or whether it's outgoing. When we're on the call, it triggers that task to turn off text received. When that call ends, the exit task is to trigger the task announce text on, which turns this profile back on so that when we receive a text message, it will work as previously. And that's basically it. Hopefully that made sense to you. Um, and it just is you know, allows you to, to do more. A lot of times when you're working with Tasker, the, the best way to uh, uh, create a task is kind of how we did it in Lesson 7, 7B, and 7C. And that's, you start off with the basic concept, like Lesson 7. I want Tasker to announce the name of the person who's texting me. And then after you've done that, and after you know that it works, then you get a little more advanced with it. What else can I do with this? Oh, it'd be cool if it announces it in different ways. So, Lesson 7b, you figure out a way to make it announce it in different ways. And then, you're on a phone call, and it announces someone texted you, and you're like, wait a second, I didn't want that to happen, how can I make that stop happening? Well, that's when you start figuring that out, and that's the list lesson, where you figure out a way to make it not announce the texture if you're on the phone. And that's how you uh, create a task. So, that's it for uh, Lesson 7. A, B, and C, uh, and you can do more things with this task if you want and get more advanced and fancy with it, but uh, that's the, uh, the basic task uh, way to have your phone announce who is texting you. Um, if you like this uh, lesson, please click the like button. Go ahead and subscribe to the channel or uh, favorite the playlist. If you want to keep up with future lessons, check out my channel for Android app reviews, NFC 101 series, product reviews, and other things. And uh, share this uh, video with anyone you want through Reddit or Facebook or Google+, Twitter, all those fun ways down there. Feel free to leave comments or questions below. I'll do my best to reply. And that is about it until next time. So have fun with Tasker.